Hello friends, welcome to USMLE team. Today I'm going to talk about tetanus vaccination in wound. Uh, this is very important topic for USMLE for step 1, CK and step 3. Very very important. You should know the flowchart and you should know the indication because USMLE will try to trick you very nicely. So if you know basics very well then you can hit them back. Okay. So before starting this discussion on this topic, please subscribe to my channel and please tell your friends to subscribe okay guys and if you're done keep repeating replaying the videos so that you get perfect okay okay uh, let me start with the first what you need to do is assess wound okay first assess the wound uh, we'll start on the right side right okay all other wounds contaminated with the dirt feces saliva soil puncture wounds avulsions wounds resulting from flying or crushing objects animal bites bones and the frostbite so these are called as uh, dirty wounds has patient completed a primary tetanus diphtheria series tell me yes or no okay he has taken this what do you do was the most recent dose within the past five years yes vaccine not needed you're lucky Patient should receive next dose at 10 years interval after the last dose. Uh, okay, and if the patient was most recent dose within the five years past five years has not taken, then administer vaccine today. Patient should receive next dose per age appropriate schedule. Okay. Okay. Has the patient completed a primary tetanus diphtheria series? no 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 and not known then administer vaccine and tetanus tig immunoglobulins okay so remember a uh, dirty wound he has not taken any vaccination or not known or he does not have taken tig right if he has taken within five years yes it was within five years then vaccination not needed no not within the uh, it was more than five years then go ahead with this uh, vaccination okay let's start with a clean wound or a minor wound has patient completed a first question remember has completed patient completed a primary tetanus diphtheria series first question should be yes or no yes he has completed was the most recent dose within the past 10 years for clean wound it's a 10 years for dirty wounds it's a five years yes vaccine not needed patient should receive next dose at 10 in 10 years interval after last dose no he has not um, a most uh, recent dose was not within the past 10 years then what do you do administer vaccine today patient should receive next dose as per age appropriate schedule okay has patient completed primary tetanus diphtheria series he doesn't know administer vaccine today instruct the patient to complete the series as per age appropriate vaccine remember a patient now i will ask you one question a dirty wound and he doesn't know the vaccination schedule what do you do vaccine plus tig and a clean wound and he doesn't know the vac vaccination schedule what do you do vaccine that's it okay so go through this once again Okay, the another point what you need to remember for a tetanus vaccination schedule or for a wound is a look at here a vaccination history clean or minor wound all other wounds. If vaccination history unknown or less than three doses in a clear or minor wounds vaccination tetanus vaccination should be given no TIG. Okay, if more than three doses he has received no vaccination. If more than ten years then you have to give the tetanus vaccination otherwise not needed no tig so tig doesn't have any role in the clear or a minor wound make a point all other wounds if unknown dose or unknown if he doesn't know the doses less than three does yes td give td and tig unknown people in in uh, dirty wounds should receive tig and td that's it more than three doses he has received First say no and if he has more than five years say yes to TD that is a tetanus vaccination 
all other modes uh, the, sorry more than three doses and um, no TIG is required if has received all the immunization for dirty wounds okay thank you so much for watching my video keep revising keep re replaying the video so that you get perfect in this thank you so much for watching my video take care